Hey there, lovely viewers. Welcome back to my channel, your go-to source for all things health and wellness. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to stay updated on our latest videos. In the current context, with the latest data indicating that over 649 million people globally have been diagnosed with COVID-19 and, sadly, over 6 million have lost their lives to this virus, it is crucial that we pay close attention to respiratory health. COVID-19 can cause inflammation and damage to the sensitive lung tissues, which play a vital role in the oxygen exchange process and the overall health of the body. This damage can lead to a variety of respiratory issues, even in those who have recovered from COVID-19. So, the question arises, how can we improve lung function? This issue concerns not only those who have battled the virus, but also anyone who wants to protect their respiratory health during these uncertain times. In today's video, we will explore practical strategies, exercises, and lifestyle changes that can help you regain optimal lung function and vitality, even after experiencing the severe impacts of COVID-19. Whether you have been directly affected by COVID-19 or are simply interested in enhancing your lung health, you have come to the right place. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and let's start this journey together to improve respiratory health. Before we delve into methods to improve lung function, let's understand the function of the lungs. The lungs are responsible for gas exchange. The activities of every organ in the body require the use of oxygen and then the release of carbon dioxide. The lungs supply oxygen to the body and remove carbon dioxide and other gases. This process occurs 12 to 20 times per minute. When you inhale, air enters the pharynx through the larynx and into the trachea. The trachea then divides into two airways called bronchial tubes. Each bronchial tube leads to one lung. Here, they further branch into smaller passages called bronchi, then into bronchioles, and finally end in alveolar sacs. The lungs contain about 300 million alveoli. Here, oxygen in the air is introduced into the blood. Also, carbon dioxide and other gases from the blood are brought to the alveoli following the air passages to the nose or mouth to be exhaled. Muscles involved in breathing include the diaphragm and intercostal muscles. If the lungs are congested or restricted, the amount of oxygen absorbed and the amount of air released will decrease, affecting the functioning of all other organs. Therefore, when you improve your lung function, you will receive many benefits for your overall health. People with chronic lung diseases such as asthma and COPD need to exercise even more to make their lungs work more effectively. So, what exercises can we use to improve lung function? You will need time to master the breathing exercises below. Try to spend 5 to 10 minutes a day practicing. Method 1. Diaphragmatic Breathing to Enhance Lung Function Diaphragmatic breathing exercises, also known as abdominal breathing exercises, allow you to breathe through your diaphragm while resting to maximize the effectiveness of improving lung function. Diaphragmatic breathing techniques are especially helpful for people with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD. If you are suffering from this disease, Consult your doctor or respiratory therapist to find the most suitable way to apply this breathing exercise. Doctors often instruct patients to breathe using the diaphragm in the following steps. Step 1. Relax your shoulders, sit or lie down on a flat surface. Step 2. Place one hand on your stomach and one hand on your chest. Step 3. Inhale through your nose for two seconds, feeling the air move into your abdomen. At this point, your belly should look like it's bulging. Step 4. Purse your lips tightly, exhale slowly, and your belly gradually deflates. 
Repeat these steps for 3 to 5 minutes each time you practice diaphragmatic breathing. Method 2. Improve lung function with light pursed lip breathing exercises. Breathing by slightly pursing your lips can slow down your breathing, giving your airways more time to relax so your lungs can function more easily. This will also improve oxygen exchange in the respiratory tract. Compared to diaphragmatic breathing exercises, pursed lip breathing is quite easy to do and can be applied without the guidance of a medical expert or physical trainer. To perform a light pursed lip breathing exercise to help improve lung function, follow these steps. Step 1. Inhale slowly through your nose. Step 2. Pucker your lips gently as if about to blow out a candle and then exhale slowly. The exhalation time can be twice as long as the inhalation time. Step 3. Repeat this movement continuously for about 3 to 5 minutes. Other ways to help maintain and improve lung function include stopping smoking or avoiding breathing tobacco smoke, prioritizing the use of foods rich in antioxidants, being fully vaccinated against respiratory system-related diseases such as the flu vaccine, pneumococcal vaccine, and COVID-19 vaccine, exercising regularly every day, Improving indoor air quality, using an air purifier if possible. Thoroughly cleaning the house. Avoiding dusty environments and polluted air. In our journey to care for and improve our respiratory health, it's vital to apply the methods and exercises we've shared. But don't stop there. Health is an ongoing process, and continuous learning, practicing, and sharing knowledge are key to maintaining and improving lung function, especially in challenging times like these. We hope the information and methods we've shared will support you on your path to better respiratory health. Don't forget to come back to us for more valuable and fresh content. Subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss any videos from us. Together, we can face and overcome any health challenges, protecting and nurturing ourselves every day. Keep following and join our community. Thank you for spending time with us today, and take care of yourself.